The Republic of Ireland football team are recruiting players from England, from Scotland and from Northern Ireland. But did you know that some of our own players are being recruited for other countries? As this report with a strategically placed camera now reveals. I was at Christy Moore gig myself a few weeks ago. Sorry, sorry, gentlemen. Sorry, Mr. Kerr. Um, can we just get on with the uh, the business? Uh, can you explain exactly what you want from uh, from my client? Okay, well, I, I know that uh, I know that you uh, you're hoping to get back in the Irish syrup and all that. But if that didn't happen, would you be interested in coming up to play with me up in the thirties? Would, would that excite you? Now I'm telling you, the thing is, and I got to say, it, you're guaranteed your place. I guarantee your place. Even if I'm injured? All the better if you're injured. You come on with them. We've only got eight full-time players and three fish in the team. You know what I mean? So it's it's it, it's a great, a great opportunity for you. And uh, am I eligible to play for the Faroe Islands? Was Tony Cascarino eligible to play for Ireland? <laughs> you know what I mean? Can I, can I just ask you um, can, how are you going to arrange the uh, the co documentation for, for Mr Reid's... Uh, Passport and you don't need a passport up in the Faroe Islands. Surely the place is 90% eagles. Anyway, it's mainly eagles. The pardon? Eagles and other boards of prey, cormorants and all them. So you don't need a passport. Any, any, it's up to you. Your call. I think I need a bit of time to think about this. Um, can I just say this? Did you play for the Leeward Celtic under 12s? I did, yeah. Then you are good enough to play for the Faroe Islands. It's a deal. Thanks. All right. Are you the agent bloke, are you? That's me. That's me. You yes. couldn't tax me car, could you? 